pada bim pada boom. I think I should change the oil and air filter before tomorrow's epic, epic, epic adventure with guys. Guys I don't even know. But they are nice enough to take me with them to drive to the southern parts of this region. So, let's see how it goes. Säätiedotus merenkulkijoille. Odotettavissa huomiseen keskipäivää asti. Suomen lähti ennen ja luoteen välistä tuulta kolmesta kuuteen metriä sekunnissa. Kuussa alkaen voimistuvaa etenemistä tuulta aamulla yhdeksästä kolmeentoista metriä sekunnissa. Aluksi hyvä näkyy. Alright, there is only four bolts, so this should be quick. Alright, then. The length seems to be equal. It doesn't matter which order I put them back. This is pretty, you know, light. Does this protect the engine? I don't know, but I'll trust my faith in you. <coughs> <laughs> this doesn't look too clean, but I don't know. It doesn't matter. I'll have to clean it up anyways after I have warmed up the engine. So, there is the oil filter. Here is the oil. And, and, and. <clears throat> you know. Then, there is these professional tools, you know, this cost something like one euro or something so this got to be good there should be somewhere something where I can drain the oil yeah here nice you know you need these professional quality things where you can drain the oil there is some mosquitoes nice you don't always need the expensive things. <laughs> nice. Oh man, there's a drop of water in there, but the filter doesn't seem any moist. And that is a good thing, of course. Where is my air filter? Here. High flow field pro. Nice. Damn it, looks kind of naked without the seat. <laughs> dirty, dirty. Hmm. Yeah, yeah, there was a little distraction. My neighbor called that he has some elk bones and what the hell, my dog likes elk bones. And so I've been doing little butchering things here and now it's time to get back to this. Yeah, let's change the filter. Filter is here. Well, there is a drop of water, which is not a good thing. This is a holy and sacred place where <laughs> nothing should enter except air. Yeah, that's nice, that's nice, that's nice. I'm not sure. It's quite dark on the bottom, so I guess there has been a little amount of water in there. Or it's just dirty, I don't know. Mm, looks pretty much the same to me. So, let's go.
Hmm. Classic. Nice. Well, have you ever seen the screwdriver that fits too well in the screw? Yeah, me neither. Guess this was an exception. Yeah, nice. Does anyone else have the same problem? The dirt sticks on the seat quite tight and it's hard to get off. If you know any good tips, I'm eager to take them. So, let's heat her up. At this moment I wonder if the bucket can hold the whole amount of oil, but you know, it will be okay. Let's open this up too. We should change the spacer. Nice. And I wonder if this is tight. <laughs> tight enough. I have the tools for this. Yeah, nice. Yeah, nice. I guess tonight we are cooking fries. <clears throat> Yeah, it's good to make sure that you wipe the oil and cover as much floor as possible. 
so it looks nice and even. <laughs> Fuck. I got to say, this is quite easy oil change. In fact, this might be the easiest oil change I've ever made. So, don't worry about it too much. And this is the part when you don't want to use too much force, I guess. That's enough, you know, really, really gentle. Ooh, this always gives me a creeps. <laughs> Pro tip, if you take this plastic thing off, the engine will work better. This one is for free. Yamaha. Made in Thailand. Nice. nice what's next should we put the oil in the engine oh, yeah. hey that worked nice Don't worry, that wasn't in the engine. <laughs> I'm pretty sure it was in this container before I changed the oil. And if you ever wonder why I'm spreading these papers all over the garage is because I use quite a lot of brake cleaner and if you you know crush the paper and toss it in the bin it might start a fire by itself so it's wise thing to leave them lay on the floor yeah enough bullshit let's go if it would be shorter it would be nice This is pretty hard. Sprit. Yeah, it would be nice if I don't get so much this plastic thing in the engine. So better to do some saving first. Yeah, that's enough. So it should be something like 2.3 liters engine oil in there. Let's see how it goes. At this time it's always good to check if you bought the right oil. Yeah, this seems nice, nice, nice. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Yeah, damn it. <laughs> Child proof. What about now? And this is the point when you see if you didn't remember to put the plug in. Am I even close to the two liters? Nah. And I can't see a spreading oil puddle on the floor, so I guess that's a good sign. Boop, 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 boop. Yeah, I usually make this sound too when it's Saturday night, but this time it's somehow different. So, now it should be 2 liters oil in the machine. It might not be enough, but I can't be sure how much oil I got drained out. 
So, no leakage in here. How about here? No, nothing, nothing. I put a little more because when I start the engine, some of the oil is going to flow to the filter and the level is going to drop. How about this? This should be good. So the level is here. I haven't started the engine yet, but let's see what happens when I gently start her. time to settle down. I think we could lubricate this change while we're waiting. Damn. Now when the bike is horizontal, the amount of oil is on the low level. But let's wait a little. There's oil slowly coming down, I guess, and we should give a little time for it. And this is the most important tool when you are lubricating the chain. What do you think? Is this enough? <coughs> well, yeah, I didn't wash my bike, so... Well, because tomorrow it's going to be so dirty that <laughs> I'll have to do proper cleaning. So, this was just a fast cleanup for the oil chains. Yeah, let's see how it goes tomorrow, but I guess it will be fun. Lots of riders that I don't know and new people. It's always a good thing to see new faces. How about that oil? still on the low side. Let's add a little bit more. Yeah, the instructions said something like 2.6 liters when you change the filter and it seems to be pretty accurate. I guess. Well, it's hard to say when the machine is horizontal, but you know, maybe I'll add a little more, but it's quite close what it should be. Yeah, this looks good. Nice, 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 nice. nice. 